what is going on YouTube? One of the XRM here. And today I am here to say it's your fault. Yep, it's my fault. It's actually our fault. It's plural, all of our faults. As riders getting into accidents. You guessed it. It's our fault. There's a lot of people that that statement is going to annoy. And it should. It's like, how the hell can you possibly say that someone pulling out in front of me is my fault and not theirs? It's because as a rider, you got to take ownership to everything. When you think about we used to see how people say that drivers need to look and everything else like that. You're trying to change a mindset to thousands upon hundreds of thousands of drivers and just completely change how they think on a daily basis. And the reality is that will never happen. You cannot control the millions of drivers that are out there. You can't dictate what they do and because of that people need to stop trying to focus on how to get drivers to notice them or get drivers to do anything that they want them to do and focus on themselves the things they can do to keep themselves safe period as a writer does it piss me off if someone comes into my lane hell yes Piss me off if someone cuts in front of me, they can let hand turn, they think they have time. You betcha. Makes the asshole pucker and all that shit. But the fact of the matter is, I didn't hit them. And they didn't hit me. And the reason for that 99% of the time is because of what I did prior to them being stupid. And not really being stupid, just being unobservant. Oh, hello, I ate. <laughs> Fleshy things, shiny things. No, but we as riders, you know, we tend to believe that when an accident happens, we are never at fault, or we aren't at fault. And I believe if you change that mindset for yourself, and go, what could I have done differently? And stop trying to place blame, just really learn from a situation. And it doesn't even have to be an accident situation, it just be a close call. It could be something you observed another rider having to deal with. Like on YouTube, you see it all the time, people do stuff. And you can look at yourself and go, huh, what could I do to make it so that I'm not in that situation? We have to really, really, really work on the things that keep us as an individual safe and not try to focus on dictating stuff that other people do. It's impossible, you never will. People are gonna be in this lane and realize that that is their exit and they will cut across three lanes of traffic and make it your problem. It's just what they do. It's you as a rider that has to look at that, notice that they're starting to lean in a lane, they're starting to trail over, they're starting to break a little bit more, they're starting to they give you tells. People do a lot of stuff and they usually telegraph what they're gonna do. If you pay attention to their vehicle, if you pay attention to what the wheels are doing. Uh, I'm telling you, it's a ton of information and I get that. And there's times where you'll get information overload and you'll end up focusing on things too hard or too long. I do it all the time. I'll go by something, somebody else stare in the window. And then I'll realize that I've been looking at them for two seconds. <laughs> That's way too long. You know, so when you ride, focus on the things that you can control. And that's you yourself as a rider and how you position yourself in the lane, 
how the speeds you're carrying, how far ahead you're looking, all that type of stuff. So this is my little vlog. It's short, it's sweet, it's to a point. Hopefully it gets you guys good and pissed off or good at thinking about what you can do differently. And then go out and have fun and ride. It's a beautiful day here in Arizona. 77 fucking degrees. This is why we live in Arizona, right here, this type of weather. Once you guys start getting in the colder climates where it starts to snow, I feel for you. Because that shit don't really happen here. It happened, I say that, but it happened last year, but that was like a week and it was done. So, oh boy. I'm gonna go to Own Any Moto, gonna record some stuff for them. I'm gonna test out a helmet. Maybe I'll do a review of that helmet if I get it. And uh, you all have a good one. I'm out.